What is happening, Magnus Sites? So, uh, I was asked to check this out. Uh, uh, it's all about the Secret Service and their job. Yeah. So, are you ready? This is on CNN. And people saying CNN, well, let me see. Let me see what they said right now. Let me see. Just in, CNN host loses it. After former U.S. Army sniper Corey Mills suggests that the July 13th assassination attempt on Trump could have been a setup. Ready? All right. Ah. Mm. All right. You know, I, I look at all of these things and I look at different videos where uh, an assailant will pull a firearm on a law enforcement officer, and the first thing they do is they immediately pull and draw and mitigate the threat and the risk. You know, I ask why look off law enforcement. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, just all these situations where a cop will do a traffic stop or they'll, you know, come up to a person's house and a person will draw, they'll draw a gun on them and the cops take them out immediately. How could it be protocol to wait for the assassin to shoot before you take them out? That makes no sense. He's just sitting up shop. He's got a campfire going with ribs on it. He's pulling out the gun, putting it all together. Setting up, he's got a pillow for his knees. And they just sitting there like, well, we got to wait and say, D are you serious? The officer did not do so. Uh, the other thing is, is that when you set an advanced team, I keep hearing this about the perimeter elements. Yeah. You know, the perimeter is actually established by your threats that are in the area. So if I don't have any threats outside of 100 yards, okay, fine, I can cord on off a certain area. But if I have a building 160 yards perfectly adjacent to the stage, that's an obvious threat, especially in an elevated position that has overwatch. Mm -hmm. That's a sniper's paradise. And, you know, we talk about ego sets. You also have, which no one talks about, but the water tower. So the what I'm hearing from you is it's not, it, it, a failure on the ground for sure, but also a failure in advance? Uh, I think it's a failure in advance. I think it's a failure to have this, the counter snipers to be able to establish their range fit and their sketch maps. I also heard, there are also, we've also learned that local snipers were stationed inside that building. Yeah, I did hear about that. They were like counter snipers were in the building. Why were they in the building instead of on top of it? I don't... I, I, I haven't heard that piece of it yet, but that doesn't necessarily make sense it. unless they were actually in a window which was backed off. Because a lot of times you yeah. get yourself in there. Sometimes you expose your rifle in a way to try and do a force protection or a show of force oh. that actually stops things. Others are actually more tactical where they'll sit back a little bit. But a sniper for the law enforcement is only trained to shoot about 75 yards, unlike your counter kind of sniper teams that are on, on set. But, but here's my problem. In, in having done this for so long, they always say the adage of ignorance is bliss, and I think that's true. I've done thousands of advances. I've done thousands of, of counter sniper operations with our teams in or, you know, Iraq and mm -hmm. Afghanistan, etc. The amount of negligence, the amount of mistakes that was made here, I have a very difficult time not leaning myself towards this was intentional as opposed to fecklessness. But wait, talk to me about that. I actually heard you intentional, which means a setup say this right um the day after which i wanted to ask you about what do you mean intentional you know you i mean I, an intentional failure on the part of no i wouldn't say an intentional failure on the part of but i kind of just uh, you know i sit here and i scratch my head you don't want to be the conspiracist you don't want to be the I, i'm telling you see he's saying he doesn't want to be a conspiracy theorist but i know now this is done and this seems like a setup that's what he's saying that's what, it, that's what it, it's leaning to. No, I, I know. And, and, and that's the issue is that you walk this fine balance of you're not trying to be a conspiracist, but you look at it and you go, how could this have gone so But it's one thing if someone on the street says it. It's not that, I mean, you, Cor Mills, member of Congress, former sniper, you saying it, I mean, it makes my eyebrows go up. What, when you say you're walking the line on this, intentional what? You know, it almost seems to me, and I think that an investigation is necessary at this point within Congress, not just the FBI, not just others. You know, I look back at it and I'm thinking, all right, if, you know, uh, for an individual, if you looked at the escalations and how they are trying to approach him, let's just say that it was like, okay, first we want to censor and silence you, then we want to indict and imprison you. Now we're attempting to kill you and take you Whoa, 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 whoa. So you, uh, let's, let's slow down. Please. Uh, I'm, I'm hearing two things from you. I don't want to. This sounds like what Andrew Tate was saying. Well, he's talking about society and the matrix and what happens. 
And these are the same stages that he talked about. This is Tyrone Tate signing off. To jump ahead of things, but I'm also hearing you jumping ahead of things. Well, actually, I'm just looking at all the different possible capabilities. You know, one of the things as a military member, but one of the things... He's staying very calm still. She's like, oh, wow, 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 Sound like Mario Kart. Wait, but one of the things as a person who's running special operations communities before, one of the people who's actually done this is that you look at all potential analysis, right? That, Donald that's Trump how and his team have said, do saying. not, that, like, no, I agree. Dial it back. But, do but, not blame this on complete. Joe Biden. Oh, well, actually, I didn't say Joe Biden. Nope, yeah, that's people. right. He didn't say Joe Biden. He's just saying it could have been a setup. Who kn From who? Who knows? Today, then. Let's be very specific. Well, that's what the investigation is, too. Was it local law enforcement that had made the mistakes? Or was there something to it? Was there uh, other types of things that we need to be analyzing uh, or looking at and, and providing analysis? My, my point is, is that when something so significant, you're talking about something that hasn't happened in decades, right? I totally, but, but, I, I, but I, my point is, is this. From I like how he's staying calm while she got, she's kind of flustered. <laughs> perspective of someone Keeping his cool. Conducted these. These are not difficult advances. This is not like I'm putting together a stage placement and a tight shot. This is about looking at your surroundings. What is my green, yellow, and red route, which is your routes out in case? What is my actual elements of, that I need to be looking at as far as mitigating threats or risks or increased levels? Where's my range fan for the sniper that says, okay, here's my 100, my 200, my sketch. Here's an area where someone could shoot. Here's some, because here's my thing. So you're Let's saying, say wait, it's a voice wait, element. you are saying this is so basic that how big the screw up was, that's what's leading your brain that, down that, this that's road. That's exactly right, in, in but, a way. But, but, but because but here's Congress the other thing, let's Tom just Emmer say was just on. Tom Emmer was just on with me, and he said very specifically to me, I wrote it down, mm -hmm. he said very good. it is too early to be talking about yes. who is at fault and who is responsible. Is. That's why an investigation is necessary. But, uh, is, it, is it not dangerous? Is it not reckless? To use, to even be throwing around the word intentionally. So to, to, to question things as we do an investigation is recklessness, because at that point, then should we never question anything? My point is this. I yeah, no, it's, it's not dangerous for an expert to say that with the way this was done, I've been doing thousands of these. This, it, the extreme ne negligence could have been intentional because there's no way with how you set this up that this can happen. You know what I'm saying? I see exactly what he's saying. Yeah, you know I mean, she keeps trying to cut him off, don't she? I, I, so I'm, not, I'm, not trying, I'm not trying but, to but be, I'm not, I and I'm not trying no, to be PC. Understand. My point but, is, but, but in the my, political environment that we were in. What would it have taken, right? Let's just say that resources was limited. Let's go with that mm -hmm. as, as a reasoning. So how many times have you seen where they just put a, a police car inside of a parking lot with not an officer in it and just leave the lights on as a deterrent? Why couldn't that have been a simple thing that was placed in? Why couldn't mm -hmm. we have said to the owner of the actual AGR company, hey, look, we don't want to disrupt your business, but we also want to make sure your parking lot is clear of people trying to park in there for the rally. Why don't we place an officer there? She's still ready to cut him off. It's too easy of a solution. And when I think about 160 I'm just so uncomfortable shots, with even having... I told you. I told you. She's still ready to cut him off. ...comfortable with having to say it. Trust me, my whole point is, is that I would like to... Hey, if it was a setup, it was a setup, and a lot of people think it is already. A lot of people think it was a setup. Some people think Trump set it up. Some people think Biden set it up. Some people think the setup set it up. Something set it up. That's what some people think. Okay? So. To look at this and say, where was the mistake made? How can we correct it in the future? Why was this actually done? But I think that this does warrant a J-13 type. Because when I think about how fast we've seen all these killings, right? Of uh, cops shooting people on video, right? We've seen a ton of this stuff, right? How fast do they get to him? How fast do they get to the perp, right? And this is the elite of the elite of the government, the Secret Service. And everybody's like, right there, or on the roof, he's got a gun, right there. And it took all that time? That bothers me. That bothers me. Because if our security is like that for the president, who wants to be president? Commission, where we can actually look at it and say, let's investigate and find out why this happened so it doesn't happen to anyone. This is not about a political thing. This is about we had an attempt to assassinate a president. Mm -hmm. We really need to understand what a serious matter this is. And this was a milliseconds or millimeter difference yeah. between this being an attempt and this being an assassination. And mm -hmm. I can tell you, at 160 yards, okay, just to give you an idea, your off-the-shelf rifle 
shoots what they call one minute of angle at every 100 yard line. So at 100, it's one inch, 200, two inches, etc. So now you're talking about 1.6 inch grouping capability of a rifle off a manufacturing line. Your average human being, because we used to do this in their standard sniper training, you're 20 inches shoulder to shoulder, 40 inches head to waist, and you're six by eight in your average head size. These are kind of the di dimensions that you look at as an average. You're talking about a 1.6 inch grouping for multiple shots on a basic rifle. We're blessed. He's speaking Chinese to me right now. I'm trying to follow it, though. I think she's trying to follow it, too. I'm kind of getting some of it. Leave the divine intervention, so I am a person of faith. I can't explain one. I hope that it was a corrugated roof, and maybe he slipped off on one of the edges of the corrugated roof, or he was rushed. But this, the whole yeah, thing, I think, sound like just she, needs to have a... Sound like she want to jump in again. Look at her. You got to look at her body language. Like, she's kind of not listening. She's wanting to interject. I've seen this before. Better explanation so that the American people and everyone can feel comfortable. And I think that's why people are saying pump the brakes because we have seen. Cons she went, she's running right on back to that. Conspiracy theories. Um, got it. You got an expert talking to you about this. You got an expert talking to you about this. Honestly, on the right and the left, I just said Donio Sullivan on. It's already going like wildfire. This is a kind. They of lucky I ain't interviewing them. I work for CNN. I'm like, oh, interview would have been fire. In a political environment that they're saying it's too hot and people are jumping to too many conclusions. Well, as a that's, I mean, that's why I am so As a military member, one of the things that we do is we what if scenario everything in the world, right? That's I know, but, it, but it, I don't know. I'm just so saying if it's the what, what if, the what if that you, you talk about maybe in an investigation and the what if that, that you, you are pre presenting on live television, I don't know. It's just. Well, so listen, I'm, I'm a public official. Yes. Anything that I do, anything that I say, I say in the public, I don't try and hide it in private. I think that the American people need transparency. He's standing 10 toes down, ain't he? <laughs> Woo! I like this guy. It's accountability and accessibility to the elected officials not to try and hide behind what we want to look at. And I also think that if we, if, if the American people know that we're questioning these things as well, it puts them at rest to at least know, why aren't they at least looking into this? Why We should look at every single situation which is of this significance. We should look at it from multiple angles to That's ensure right. that nothing is left out. That's nothing right. could be potentially claimed as being covered up. Yeah. We need that's to right. have more transparency to the American people. That's I think right. That's what everyone deserves. But a full... Investigation. Full investigation. Before anyone that's right. points at fault. That's exactly right. How and that's why I say I lean. I have not made an accusation of something. I just want to make sure we're covering our bases to ensure that we get a proper investigation at all levels to ensure this doesn't happen again and that our president can be safe. Congressman, thank you for coming in. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you. i got to follow this guy. I like him. Woo! Well, things are heating up. What else y'all want me to do? Post comments down below. Let me know what you, uh, you know what I mean? What you think about this situation. Any more details, post them in the comments section. I might be doing one more video tonight. I, you know what I'm saying? So we're going to see. 10 million subscribers.